Doctors are trying something new to give hope to children born with severe heart defects. Chris Martinez reports on the groundbreaking trial in Los Angeles that may help these kids live much longer lives. You breathe a sigh of relief when you hear her breathe. Eva Weiler was 20 weeks into her pregnancy when doctors diagnosed her unborn daughter Elise with hypoplastic left heart syndrome, commonly called HLHS. She has half of a heart. Her left ventricle really doesn't exist. Elise. The diagnosis is devastating and you, you look for anything that's going to give you hope. Sweet girl. Children with HLHS typically undergo three surgeries that allow the developed side of their heart to pump blood to the entire body. But by early adulthood, the heart starts to fail. So doctors at Children's Hospital Los Angeles are trying something new, collecting the baby's cord blood at birth to gather stem cells. When the child undergoes their second HLHS surgery, we're going to inject the stem cells into the right ventricle. Dr. Ram Kumar Subramanian believes in Injecting the stem cells directly into the heart will help stimulate muscle growth, making it stronger. And the hope is that this will delay or even prevent heart failure in this subset of patients. Researchers say so far they're seeing positive results in children who received the injections as part of a clinical trial. You sleepy girl. Eva is hopeful it will make a difference. I want to give her every possible chance that I can. A chance for a stronger heart and a longer life. Chris Martinez, CBS News, Laguna Niguel, California.